Another beautiful custom room based on Android 13 is here. Android 13 is already released in its stable state and a lot of custom rooms are coming based on Android 13. Most of the custom rooms are with their initial builds and you might get some basic or maybe very 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 much less bugs on, their, on your devices. But yes, you can still use it if you want to. You can use those things as your daily driver. We are talking about Cherry Show's version 4.0 based on Android 13 in this video. And Cherry Show's was also one of the best custom rooms based on Android 12 and Android 12.1. There were a lot of customizations included. What about Android 13? It was expected that Android 13, they will bring some new features and expectedly a lot of features have been added. We'll talk about all those features. Uh, stay tuned for in this video. I'll talk about all those things here. First of all, as it was expected too, that we might get the Pixel Launcher pre-installed so yes this is what we have pixel launcher is not a bad deal but yes in the upcoming times when launcher will be updated or their own cherish launcher or etc etc they might give you but right now this is what we have is pixel launcher if i move on to the quick settings panel as in android 13 we have the dark quick settings background as expectedly but in this one we have the light quick settings background if you use the light mode instead of the dark mode and the tiles you can see the quick setting tile style is actually changed and you can also change this if you want to it's up to you let's just quickly talk about this thing because this thing matters a lot i found in one custom even i don't remember that but i i found that safe net was not working safe net was not passing in that room but thankfully in this version safeness status has no issues you'll be able to use banking apps without root on your devices if i talk about the google photos unlimited storage it is there as you can see this pixel can back up unlimited photos and videos at no charge so this might be a really good thing and yes it's available as an option you can turn off that you can turn on that the option is available in settings we'll talk about that later on this is the settings way which we have so no major ui changes in this one which was expected too but we have cherished settings where all the features and customizations have been added but before moving on to that let's just talk about the game space this is the game space what we have in the initial builds like in evolution xos initial build the game space was not included yes in the previous update version 7.1 they have given you the game space but in this version cherish was first initial build based on android 13 includes the game space i don't have any major games installed i don't play games if you don't know i don't play games at all but yes some apps are included let me show you by applying this game space in this app so let me just give you an idea that how this game space is looking like as you can see you'll see time and we also have a battery and cpu and maybe the battery temperature or cpu temperature and fps info etc etc all those things as expectedly already included one thing which is missing from here which at least because a lot of things have been added i was expecting that face lock or app lock anything nothing is there you only have the fingerprint option available for your security which might not be a big deal but yes this is what we have you cannot use face unlock and app lock right now in this version but in the upcoming versions the things might be changed if we move on to the cherry settings as you can see the ui is same like android 12 or android 12.1 and yes as honestly i was not expecting but there are tons of customizations included and maybe this is one of the only custom rooms which includes a lot of customization based on android 13. first of all in miscellaneous you can see unlimited photo storage which i just talked about previously and as you can see already things are available in notification panel for example make heads up less annoying one of my favorite features it's already there and in call vibration options already present vibrate on connect vibrate on call waiting and vibrate on disconnect if you talk about the power menu options you have advanced restart you have screenshot and you also have other options so if you want to enable those things you can no worries in that thing too if I move on to the lock screen customizations, you have the edge lighting, you have the show charging info, this is quite useful and the media cover art option is also there where you can adjust the blur amount also. If you if you want more blur, you can enable that thing, you can, enable, you can change that meter, increase that meter if you want to. Animations, customizations are basically empty might be not polished yet in the upcoming updates we might see new things included here system navigation and gesture navigation you can see the space under the keyboard the same thing which is present in evolution xos also 
and yes quite useful for you if i move on to the theming section in theming section what we found here is of course a black theme so if your device has amoled display you might definitely love this if you use dark mode of course and some fonts customizations fonts basically includes a lot of things menrop is what i had applied so far let me try to change it to product sense and in my case it's working perfectly fine the font engine is just working perfectly fine the font might be changed everywhere it was expected that android 12 to android 13 there might not be biggest changes no major visualization changes so yes it was expected too this is i liked a lot in status bar some customizations volty and the background chip and clock you just saw things are basically quite good in this version this was about cherry shoes version 4.0 if you want to install this thing you can right now i think so while making this video it's only available for me 11x poco f3 and redmi k40 all these devices of course unified but yes if your device does not did not give this or did not have this build yet you might get update very very soon stay tuned and yes this is all from today's short and simple video if you like this video don't forget to like and share this also if you're new here don't forget to subscribe the channel a lot of customer videos are coming very soon thanks for watching and goodbye